I mean, it's easy. Look at this. 66, 45, 70, like 56. And it's just profit after profit after profit. So many coins. At least 30k this video. Easy coins. Easy coins. Yes, lads. Welcome back to another video. So, the market's busy, man. A lot of people are up as well because of the uh, SBC requirements for the market matchups, which you need an engineering degree to complete. Like... I don't know why they've done it so hard where like, you need three teams and 80 rated and this amount and that amount and it's just an absolute joke so a lot of the 80, 80 rated pluses have gone up through the roof you can see here Ben uh, Bender here we've gone for 2k I thought he was going for about 2.6 it turns out he's like 3k yeah he's 2 9 there, if that was a snipe then. What's 3k? 3k in about 30 minutes, so he's actually up to 3k, um, believe it or not. Ah, there's one for 400. Do you know what? I was trying to snipe this guy as well, and I was getting no luck. There you go, 2 1. So we've got another one there, which we can exit and sort out later. We did get outbidded on a few. Uh, before we had jump into the video lads if you could like subscribe to the channel it'd be awesome let me know in the comments as well down below how many coins you've got and i can try to do a video on it on you know best players to trade with best best methods and things like that uh i can probably go in and help you then a lot of people are like if you've got like you know anything over like five six hundred k you can you can do mainly anything um it, it's just like what you like right so if you've got like 500k but you're not using it you can either have two for k and invest in if you're comf comfortable with investing and then um you can go on and, and and snipe with the rest or trade with the rest or if you've got like 100k i probably wouldn't invest in because you're gonna need you're gonna need coins to trade with so 100k is probably where you'll be at at a good hopefully we can get this one at a good like you know um starting point if you've even got like 10k Something like this will work. So we've probably made what? Uh, it's 159. Like, we're probably on like three and a half, nearly 4k on just the benders we've got. Because we've obviously got one there that was sniped. Um, and when the market is hella busy, you can literally go along and bid on them. A sniper one thing coming up often. I don't know why. Probably, he's probably not the best player to snipe, but he's a good player to bid on. Um, there we go, we've got one for 2k there, we get, I bid 2-2 two, two, so it's still profit, um, I'm just going to go ahead and bid 2k, it might put them off, um, I mean I nearly got this one for like 900 coins but someone bid, outbid me on like 3 seconds which was an absolute joke, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring you back if we get any of these, um, yeah, I let you know if we get right. He can go. I let you know if we get any of these. I bring you back, and um, we'll go from there. Okay then, lads. So we're looking at a few players, right? We're looking at Payet. He's selling about three two, um, which means there's only about 160 coins. So anything under three k would be profit. Even if we go for someone like, I mean, everyone's kind of bidding two seven, and they're winning him for two seven, which is. Kind of a shame. I'm not going to go to eight because it's kind of pointless at this point. All the benders sold, which was nice. Um, and then let's have a look at let's have a look at Payet's price. If he's gone up, I'm going to be a bit gutted because I've got a bit of more. And he's still about. It's more than it's more than three two. It's not three four. It's about three three. Yeah, all right. I, I mean, I'd say 3-2. I'd probably be comfortable sending them at 3-2. So it's only about 160 coins tax. Um, and as you can see, a lot of them went for 2-7, which I got this one for 2-7, which gives me like 340 coins profit. And I know what you mean. It's not it's not um, the best profit, right? Well, if I did get all of them for 2-7 and we're getting free profit, free 320 coins profit, I mean, four of them cards would have been over, it's like 1.2, 1.3k profit. So you've got to look at it like that. And not only that, I'll be bidding on these. So if we're going to bid on Payette for 2.7, not only that, we're then going to go and bid on another lot that we can make coins on. 
and um, and then you've got like kind of two lots of coins coming in, right? So you've got, so it, it kind of makes it worthwhile. So I'm gonna go across here, but on two seven because I know for a fact I'll make my coins back regardless, right? Um, and it looks like that's kind of what people are willing to bid up to, because I don't think I'd bid two eight if I want to make coins on him, and I think people ain't got the patience to go and buy him if they need him like this. I think they're just going by the lowest buy now which gives uh, people like us traders a better chance of selling. And then I looked at Bakioko earlier, how I search my players, right? So I'll go to the SPCs, you kind of need French players. The so French players go to about a thousand coins, right? A thousand one, it, it doesn't really matter at this point. And you can go across, you're looking at players like fullbacks, rare, between 79 and, and 81, 82 rated. So between 79 and 81 rated, I'd say. Uh, and then we've seen Bakioko, right? So we've seen, um, I'm not sure what Bakioko's price is. That's not Bakioko. So Bakioko's price has got to be what? A thousand coins, right? So it's about a thousand coins. So you want to try and get some for 750. The market's busy. They, they could pop up. But cards like this. Let's have a look at like 1 1 though. What, what's 1 1 looking like? Okay, 1 1 is there. 1 2. Always be sure as well when you're bidding. If you just search for like a thousand, uh, and they'll probably come up there at eight fifty, bye. And then you can go and put them up for like one one, right? It's not the mess. It's not the most profit, but if you've got like ten k, this is ideal, right? And you'll see why because that's a thousand coins there. Is what one one? Did I say he was one one? Yeah, he's one one. So you want to go? I'd say. 750 right go or even yeah eight, i mean 800 would do because you're selling quite quick off so 650 even if you want to go 700 i got a few of these cards uh in the stream today to trade uh to put into the uh 80 pluses for 700 so i'm gonna go and bid 700 i know i can sell them for 1.1 that doesn't bother me but it looks like oh it's only like 200 coins profit well yeah but if i get all of these and there's 10 there, that's 2k profit. Uh, and you're just constantly selling, right? You're just constantly selling. You won't probably get a more, you'll probably get outbidded. Um, I'm going for 700, you'll probably get outbidded up to like 750 or something. So, and then as we're doing this, look, as you can see, let's go to 3 2. Now that's about 300 in, I think it's 340 coins a player, right? Doesn't seem a lot, no, but. How many have I got here? Two, three, four, five. I've got six. So it starts to add up quickly. Um, and why I got these, I only bidded on them and then I went and got another player. So when the market's busy, it is best to, to bid because you can get so many more players than just sniping. Sniping limits you to like one player a snipe, where bidding, it can limit you like as many as you bid on. Go to three, two. And then three, two, happy days. And then while we've done this, there should be back Yoko's there. I think there might be one or two more pirates. I'm not sure. We got outbidded on quite a few. We did win quite a few. We did get another. We get quite a lot of pirates again. Back Yoko for eight there, eight there. It's going for eight there. It's going for seven fifty, nine fifty, seven fifty. Seven fifty is probably where you're at with Bakioko. You'll start noticing as well, like the like the highest amount of bids you get. So we did get some for seven, obviously seven hundred and eight hundred, but it looks like seven fifty is quite a solid price to get him for. So let's go here. We can sell Bakioko for one one, I believe, wasn't it? So and then Payette for three two. So we go Payette three two. Payette three two. And then we've got two more pirates, so three, two. Now, I wouldn't advise you doing this, just mass listing them up. But the where the market's busy, I don't think it will impact this price that much. And then back here, okay, 1-1. One, one. It doesn't seem a lot, but you've just got so many coins now that are generating in. Every little bit's helping at this point. So you've got back here, okay, there. And then we didn't get any of them. If we did, that would be nice. That would be more, right? And now, as you can see... Back here, okay, sold straight away. We've got a pie that's sold, all the bends are sold, and these cards are just going to start coming in. Now, we've got 
How many cards have we get a pie out? You've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, ten. Eleven. So we got eleven at like what? Three forty um, profit. So that's three thousand seven hundred and forty profits. So we made plus with the back here goes. You're looking at like four, just over four k, right? Just over four k profit in like ten minutes, which is all right, right? But we missed out on quite a lot of back here. Okay, so you can do this again with Payet. You can go to. Is he about three one? I mean, it's probably gone down, trickling down a little bit. What's three two looking like? I've got a lot up as well. Looking about, yeah, there's a few there. He will sell. Um, so again, you can go and do this, but you can go to like two six, right? Maximum buy now of two six. So you can just give yourself. I'll go two four. Someone bids me for two five. I can then go two six. That gives me a chance just to get him a little bit cheaper. Two four. But it also gives them the uh, the willingness to go a bit more on the bid, which we don't really want. But um, it ju it just it's that chance of just getting them a bit cheaper, which obviously gives us more profit. So again, you can go to like any league. So um, you can go to Sierra A, right? Because uh, I know there's an SBC for Sierra A, and it's like a max of like two clubs. So you can go. Uh, Napoli is one of them, right? So let's have a look at Napoli players. One five. All right, that's probably that could be a good pull. I don't really know at the moment. We've got one eight. So I look at like one seven. Okay, so one seven. Don't forget to always keep searching for the lowest. Lorente looks like he's probably the cheapest. Uh, you can go across the 59th minute. That's a that's a bargain right there. I know that it's a fullback. So. You're looking at about one seven, right? To instantly buy. You want to go to like one three. Now, obviously, you've got numerous chances to get absolutely anyone for Napoli at one three. So goalkeepers, eight red goalkeepers who could be going for more. The fullbacks will be going more for the one seven. So this is just kind of like a goal mind if you can get them. Can we try and snipe? I mean, I'm I'm quite fast at doing this. But some people are just absolute gods at this, and it's ridiculous. Here we go. Like, I'm not even a second. Someone's faster than a second. Look, it's mental. If you can get in on this. Oh, Jesus, man. This is... I've missed out on some coins. I was on the hour mark, and I've still missed that. I think that searched me again, which I've missed that one as well. Great, man. I've missed it. You know you've missed it when it's already got the um, the 59th minute on. You've got to be very lucky to get it like that. When it's already had seconds gone in it. Because a lot of people will be doing this at the moment. You could probably go and try a team that isn't in demand as much. Uh, oh my god. I just wanted to get one right. So. 1-7. Let's go 1-3. And then. I'm going to bid 1-3 on Napoli players right. Hopefully. People stay away. It looks like a lot of people are sniping. So. I'm going to try and go 1-3. I know that's profit, and obviously some people are going for a little bit more than 2.7. That just got bought out straight away. I don't understand that. I'll go 1 free because I think that would be safe. I've probably been outbidded on an absolute bunch. I'll go 1 four, stuff it. Um, I want to just want to trade it then. One, three. I mean, look how many there are, man. Look how many there are. You, you're bound to get. You're bound to get some, right? Not everyone can see every card up. I'm not sure how much Ospin's going for, but it's got to be more than 1-7. I didn't see one for 1-7. Lorente looks like probably the one you'll get for 1-3. You could go safe, go 1-4, but profit-wise, it's not really the best, is it? Um, 
I'll get one for. No, I don't know his price. So I don't really want to bid what I don't know. I bid one three one four because I know I know for a fact it, I can get rid of him for that. Right, so that will do for the bidding. Right, I don't want to bore you with all just the bidding. Um, ten is still selling. That means the pirates are selling. We've got a bunch of pirates for two four here. One three, one two four there. As you can see, that as well with all this, we didn't get a pirate there. They went for a bit less than I was going for. It looks like the Laurentes is where you're at, really. So we've got a bunch of pirates to still put up. We've got a bunch of Laurentes, which we're going to go for one seven. Let me put all these up, right? I'm going to put the pirates up, uh, and then I'll bring you back and we'll see where we are. Again, as we've listed everyone up, uh, as you can see, a lot of people are selling. We were, I think, we started uh, trading on about one one mil three hundred and twenty k, something like that. So as you can see, we've had to put up pi for like down to two eight between two nine because that's kind of where his price is at. Like I did say, there's a lot less demand for him now because a lot of people have already bought him, put him into the SBCs. Um, so that's why you always bid lower as the night goes on, keep an eye on their prices. Um, this guy sold for one seven and one eight. We picked up for one three. As you can see here, the Pyatt's with three point two k on him. We've actually forty five minutes left on him. I done the stupid thing of mass listing them up just because I'm impatient. Um, and that's not that's not the way to go. I wouldn't say that. I'd say probably do one or two at a time. Wait for them to go. One two at a time. Wait for them to go. Uh, you should be all right with that. You can do this with numerous players, right? It doesn't really matter. Uh, what you're going with and the thing is why it's so good to make coins is yeah It looks like three four hundred coins a card, but like here. I've got 56 items on I've sold 46 46 cards that I've you know that I've just shown you that here you can do it with the so mass bidding currently works Because there's a lot on the market, right? That's that's why mass bidding works mass bidding doesn't work when You've got to wait 10 minutes for five players that that's that doesn't work mass bidding is like you get 15 to 20 players in less than three minutes so you can do this for absolutely anyone um why the Sierra a and that is good at the moment is i think even milan would work um yep yeah, i think milan would work probably the same price as you're looking at like one eight there one nine let's have a look so one nine you're probably there yeah, one eight you'll be safe with 1-8, I mean, what a right back scan for, for, for Inter. Like 1-9, one 1-8. Nine, one so yeah, you're looking at like that price for Inter. And then, I mean, well, you know, you, one eight. so all you got to do, there you go, 650. I can put, this left back's probably going, it could be going for a bit more than I think. Um... So let me just go to left back, and then after a while, you'll kind of get the gists of um, what players are going for. So I'll look at two K. Yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna go out and say like one eight. Yeah, he's one eight. So that's probably what you're looking at. You could probably go like one four. That that won't that won't trouble you. Or again with the mass bidding, go to one three. Get these up like as soon as you can. Don't don't wait around because the longer you wait around, the the longer they've got to go down. Don't put them all up at once. I wouldn't recommend that. Um, I've done it stupidly though. I wouldn't. Oh god, I wouldn't say do that. Uh, as well with your players, if you do mass bin and pick them up, go and have a look at their price individually, even if it's foot bin or anything like that, because. Some players have a lot more demand due to nationalities and positions. Um, I don't know how much Martinez is. I'm not going to get him for one free though. So that's all I'm going to go with Inter. Um, and yeah, just just do who you're comfortable with, man. Go on the market, see who's about. Look at their prices. It could be any teams. Like I'm pretty sure you could probably do this with United players. If we go and have a look at United players, like. It, at this moment in point, a lot of a lot of teams, like well-known teams, are in um in demand. Like, all right, maybe not because you've got James and Ingalo, but let's say if we went like defenders, right? Probably like the worst example I could have picked. 
like what? One, two. One, one. One K. Oh God, I mean, really? 950. All right. Probably the worst example I could have picked, right? But if we get a gold, okay. We're looking at the lot. It's probably sold by now, no? We know Maguire's good. I know Maguire's good. So Maguire could be a player that you pick up, right? Um, it might be like what? 1, 4, 1, 5, 1, 6, 1, 7, 1, 9, 2K. Yeah, man, look how expensive he is because of his rating at the moment. 3.3k. 3.6. 3 3.8. 3 I mean, I, I wouldn't know he's at. I mean, I'd probably throw him out for like 2k. So, I know he's like, what? 3.7. 3 3.6, I know for a fact I can get rid of him for. I'm going to go and mass bid on a lot of these. What I'll do is... I mass bid on these, see if I can get any. Uh, I'll bring you back, put them up, the ones we do get if we get any, and then I'll bring you back once everyone's kind of sold. Uh, and then we'll go from there, see how much profit we've actually made. Okay, boys, we look at Maguire's prices between 3536. Um, we've, we've picked up another one as well. Uh, we've put them up for good prices 2K, 2.3, 1.7, 2.2, 2.5. 2 .2, 2 uh, we did get another one as well, which he, where is he? I think it'd be this one. 2.3, 2K, 2.5, 1.8, 1 1.7. 1 I think it's the 1.8 that was in here. Uh, we know these are selling for 1.7. So we can go and put these up uh, that we got earlier. Uh, 1.7. I'm actually not sure on their price. We did get a snipe for 6.50, which I'm going to put for 1.6. Uh, hopefully he can go. And a Maguire. Oh, um, I'm going to go one six because I'm not sure on their price if they've gone down or not. And a Maguire we can actually go and put for three six as well. I put some of the ones I got cheap. So this one I put for three five because uh, I want to mass list them up. So the ones I've got a lot cheaper I put for cheap, and then the ones I got for like two five onwards I will probably put for three six. Uh, one eight this one again. Look, I mean this. It's so easy at this stage to make coins uh, when the market's busy. Uh, this is what I love about like, uh, well, this is why I did want to go to PlayStation because this is with 1.9 mil on the market. Imagine it's five to six mil like every day. Uh, it'd be a blast. So 3.5, happy days. We're up to 310. So we did say we started on about 320. Um, Maguire's have sold, quite cool, right? They're all right, and then we've got back here goes that side. What we'll probably get caught out is on as these payettes. Um, hopefully, this price doesn't go down too much, and then we can kind of make our money back. But 313, even if we 35 as well. Um, did I get the money for him? I'm not sure, but even if we did, right. We're looking at a like what? Did I, it's about twenty. Looking about thirty k profit. I'm gonna have to go back on the video because I remember recording the intro and then I mucked it up and then I done it again. So I'm gonna see what the coins I actually started on. Uh, it gives me a better idea. I didn't. I normally say what, what you know what we're starting on things like that, but I think at the start of this video I already had players bidded on. But I can kind of work it out, so that's not too bad. I um I bring you back once the majority have sold. Probably these payettes ain't gonna sell anytime soon. So Nors Lorente, which is a shame. Um, have a look actually. Is it is a is he Napoli player? He is, isn't he? So forty four minutes on him. Right, one six. Damn, I mean you can still make a bomb on Napoli players probably. Um 
Yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm bringing back once the majority of them are sold and I'm going to work it out from there. Okay, lads, so I just looked back on the video. Um, we were starting on about 213, no, 313k, which we're already in profit for. So we're already in profit and we've got still probably, um, let's have a look, like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. About 20k, probably about 20k left to sell. So we're actually doing alright. Someone else has actually sold. Um, yeah, so we've actually probably made 20. Yeah, pushing 30k, pushing 30k. Uh, that that's just considering I've said two 2k on the payettes, which we'll probably get two five. So I mean, all two six, two seven. So that'd be 10, 15, 20. And then one, two, three, four, five. Uh, yeah, about 20k, 21, 22k, something like that, which is actually not bad. Um, so, yeah, if you like the video or anything, that's going to be the end. I do need to end it now, so I want to render it and get it out for tonight. And it's currently, what, half eight, half nine. You'll probably get this about 10 o'clock. Um, apologies for that, for the late one. But I'm guessing everyone's sleeping patterns like mine, absolutely destroyed. Um, but, yeah. Um, good luck in your weekend league tomorrow if you're in it. Um, subscribe if you're new. If you lasted this long, I do appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.